NanoCAD makes it effortless to offset objects by making parallel copies. The offset command is found here on the ribbon. To start the command, click the button and then look down on the command bar for prompts. It first asks for an offset distance and I'm going to enter in 10, press enter, and then it asks for the object to offset. So I'll click this polyline and then on the command bar it asks specify on which side to place the offset. So I've placed it on this side. You can repeat it or you can cancel the command, restart it by pressing the space bar, pressing enter for the offset distance, selecting the object, press M for multiple, which lets you do multiple offsets. So now just keep clicking on the one side to create the offsets. Now the reason I drew this polyline was to show you what happens with curves. When you're offsetting a curve, NanoCAD has to reduce the radius until finally the offset turns into a straight line. Naturally, you can also offset on the other side. If you've made an error with offsetting, the command has a built-in undo option to remove offsets in reverse order. When you offset straight lines such as this rectangle, then the curve problem doesn't occur, although the rectangle itself gets smaller and bigger. When you first start the offset command, there's three useful options at the very beginning, through erase layer. The through option lets you specify the offset distance by picking a point. Here's the circle I'm going to offset and I want the through point, i.e. the offset distance to be this line here. Pick here for the through point and now go the offset circle is as big as the distance to the line. The erase option removes the object that you're offsetting. So I'll choose it. It's asking me if I want to be sure I want to do that. So I type yes, specify the offset distance, 10, select the object offset, and pick a side on which to offset. The original circle is gone, keeping only the offset one. The third option at the start of the offset command is named layer, and it's for designating which layer the offset copies should be placed on. The way this works is you first have to create the layer on which to send it. Create a layer called pink, and the color is magenta. And so in the command line, I'll click on layer, and then it asks, do you want the offset copies to be placed on the source layer, which is the same layer as the original object that you're doing the offsetting to, or place it on the current layer? And I've selected current, and now once again we have the offset distance, and select the object to offset. So I've clicked on the circle, specify the side, and there the offset copy appears on the layer named pink.